<laughs> M4 needs a wash. I feel so bad. Look how this, look at how dirty the M4 is. This is unacceptable. This is crazy. We got like random water spots. We got bugs that we killed from Vegas. More water spots up here. This is unacceptable. What is going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Now I'm not gonna show my face here because I just woke up. We're gonna go and wash the M4. We're gonna come back, we're gonna get ready, we're gonna go photo shoot the M4, and then we're gonna talk about how much have I spent on the M4 from exterior wise to interior wise to performance wise. So without further ado, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button, the like button, turn on the post notifications, follow me on Instagram, and let's get on with the video. Alright guys, we're here at the car wash. Gotta give the M4 wash. It is super, super dirty like I said. And actually, I think it's supposed to rain. Shit. Should I still wash it? <laughs> Need content for the gram. So if you guys are following me on the gram, make sure you guys go and do that. 20k subs guys, make sure you guys are subscribing. It's easy, just one click. 20k, let's go. This is gonna be like the easiest car wash ever because all we do is just rinse it down. So I'm gonna set the camera up right here. See if I can set it up on this side. See if I can balance it somehow, maybe like right here. Three dollars. All right, there she is, all wet. We gotta go and dry her down. Look at that. Jeez. I love it. It's just so easy. It's just water. You just rinse it down with water. Sometimes I use a shampoo. BMW has a shampoo for uh, matte paint. Um, but I don't like to use it too often. So usually just watering it down. <laughs> Looks freaking clean. I'm going to add some tire shine when we get to the little photo shoot spot. So it can look good. But Man. I love when the M4 looks clean. Damn, man. Imagine just having your Lamborghini parked out just like that in the street. All right, guys, I'm back. So right now we just finished getting ready. And um, right now I'm about to go photo shoot the car, like I said. And we're going to talk about all the prices and how much I've spent so far on the M4 GTS build. So let's get on with the video. All right, guys, we are here at El Yazian Park. It's here. You guys can see, like, there's downtown area. Overlook of the stadium. You got these beautiful palm trees up here. Just did a couple of photos right now. Um, so let me park somewhere and let's get started with the video. What you guys were waiting for. On how much we have spent so far on the m4 all right guys let's start off with the exterior of the car so we have the uh carbon fiber eyelids which were 80 dollars. we have the upper trim which was 135 on the bumper we have the carbon fiber diffuser which was 625 the mirror caps were 220 side skirts were 450 spacers were 290 and the floating center caps were 106 dollars. so that totaled out to 1906 on just the exterior and there's still a few more mods that i need to do on the exterior okay so now moving into the interior of the car um, we have the paddle shifters we have the gear cover we have the m1 m2 we have the start stop we have the shift console we have the e-brake we have the steering wheel trim all of that totaled out to 1140 so paddle shifters were 380 the gear cover was 150 the m1 m2 was 40 dollars the start stop button was 30 dollars the shift console was 165 the e-brake was uh, 95 dollars the steering wheel trim carbon fiber was 280 so that totaled out yes to 1140 just on the interior and there's still more interior mods that i got to do that are going to definitely double up the price of the interior the moment you guys have probably all been waiting for is how much did we spend on performance mods and uh there's still a lot more stuff we got to do <laughs> but uh okay so let's start off with the performance so let's start off with boot mod stage one uh tune that was 400 the downpipes and charge pipes were 600 the intakes were 479 the j pipe was 130 and the catch can was 200 and that totaled out to 1809 just for a performance and um there's still a few other things i got to do like crank cub and um you know there's still other couple of bolt-ons that i got to do on the m4 but so far that's how much we've spent on the car for performance wads now calculated everything total together and it came out to a total of four thousand eight hundred and fifty five 
That's how much I've spent so far on everything on this car. And like I said, there's still more to come. Just be patient. More mods coming soon. Here's the entire list. I don't know if you guys can see everything. I wrote it down. So, pretty crazy, guys. <laughs> but let's just all admire this beautiful view that we have here of the downtown LA. And then over there on that side, you got the whole Dodger Stadium right there, which is pretty cool. All right, guys. Also, before we continue the rest of the video, I also want to say um, you guys are probably waiting for the Vegas vlog, the Eurofest. Um, I vlogged like the whole like I guess like the beginning of it but then like after that I kind of just like didn't really get to vlog much it was just like little bits and pieces of like the cruise and just like it really wasn't much I still have a video for it to be posted like I just don't know if I want to throw it up there just because it's not it wasn't really anything crazy um nothing that you know like for me to be like okay like this is something worthy for you guys to watch but if you guys are still interested i can still throw the video up there just comment down below what do you guys think um it's about a 10 minute vlog i believe but i just wish i would have captured more i just couldn't we just had you know we're having so much fun and stuff so i apologize um maybe i might throw this video out that week that that Eurofest vlog i might throw it out this week so we'll see but right now we're gonna go stop by masterminds we're gonna go see what they're up to what they've been up to i haven't seen them since before vegas so Let's continue the video. <laughs> baby revs, baby revs. I don't want to get kicked out of here now. But to all my subscribers, where is this uh, view from? It's in a movie, but what movie? If you guys are smart, you guys will know. If you guys know it, comment down below. There's a Dodger Stadium right there, guys, if you guys can see it. I love LA, man. I don't think I can move anywhere else. I freaking love LA. Damn, what you know about that VIP parking though? M4 GTS with the M4 CS. We about to get some sushi right now. Start off with some water, you know, we gotta stay hydrated, you know? All I need is some lemons. Jeez, spicy garlic edamame, that's the wave. Ooh, look how fire this looks. I'm about to eat good. Up next is this beautiful lobster hand roll right here. Bam, I'm about to dip it in this sauce. What you know about it? Dang, Mario's E90 M3. Jeez. Did you do anything to it or not yet? Huh? Did you do anything to it or not? Fix the window. Oh, yeah, that's right. I had tape on it last time. <laughs> and you got the Top Speed X pipe. Are you going to do muffler delete or are you going to buy actual exhaust? Uh, well, it's got the OEM exhaust mod, so I'm gonna leave that for now. Oh, actually, the OEM exhaust mod, with that, it'll sound good. It's it gonna be freaking good. loud. It sounds good. Oh, yeah. Dang, the new Lime Rock Mobile. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously. This is sick. Hey, put my put my logo on there on, on, the, on the door somewhere. What's up? ¿Qué pasa, mijo? ¿Cómo estás, Don Humberto? Bien, ¿y tú cómo estás? Muy bien, muy bien. Todos dicen que tú tienes dinero. <laughs> Is that true? Hey, I was in Vegas this weekend. Yeah, I went. Wow. It was, it was crazy. How was it? Dude, this X7 is freaking nice. Frozen black paint. This shit is sick. And it's brand new too. Look. Woo. Brand new. Look at that. Interior lighting. Look at that. That is freaking nice. Frozen black X7. Now that is something you don't see all the time. That is freaking beautiful. They got another X3, X5, I don't know what this is. They got a Porsche here. This one is like a Carrera. I don't even know to be honest. What is it? Oh yeah, 911 Carrera. They got a 335, 340 with the OLED style. These are the shadow line ones. Half and half. Got the M8 Comp. We got my car and we got Carlos's car. Damn, they got a full house. There are nothing but like BMWs in here. That's just crazy. Yeah, there's the homies van right here. This new business. And what a great color that they're doing it in orange, right? <laughs> and then they're gonna put the logo up there and shit. I'm gonna tell them to put, I'm gonna sign right here, Lime Rock M3 or something. Um, that red was burgundy? Nice. <laughs> burgundy and then the wheels were this silver. Let's put those on the GTS. Dude, this shit is actually freaking nice. It's got a nicer interior than the E9X M3s. Like yours. <laughs> That show looks really nice, bro. Kevin Ronner, Mario's on Mario yet. <laughs> Mario, hasn't, Mario hasn't took delivery yet. Yeah. So Man. Uh, he has to make sure he, uh, he could uh, afford it. 
Yeah, there's Karami. I can't wait to see it wrapped and everything, bro. It's gonna look nice. This, because right now, you know, like it's clean, but. I just saw it from the I know, I know it's not that clean, huh? It's not that clean. All right, all right, serious question. Should Mario wrap the E90 yellow with the yellow cage or Laguna Seca blue with the Laguna Seca blue cage? I think Laguna Seca blue would be hot fire. Alright guys, that's it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to hit that subscribe button, the like button, turn on the post notifications, follow me on Instagram. See you on the next video. Take care. Peace.